for all that you have done to help the kids in this area. Toys for Tots is really important to me, and we have a lot of volunteers like Kristen here who, who actually does your dealership. She is the one who does the boxes with okay. the toys. Yeah. But thank you. You guys went above and beyond this year, and we so appreciate it. This is a floating trophy, and you can see we put you on here for 2021. So if you do it again next year, you'll get another that's, one right next to it. That's, um, that's so, our plan. Yep, and then we won't know to the end of the year yeah. who gets their award, and then we'll do this again in the awesome. beginning well, of the year. Well, thank you so much. So you guys hang on to it for now, and, and we so appreciate all, it. All our associates here participated, and the technicians, a lot of them put the bikes together and they love that and you know get get you know just bring something that needs to be put together and they're all over it uh but we reached out to our vendors as well and they were we had some great vendors our our landscaping company t and r landscaping rocky um, uh, um, taylor thank you rocky taylor uh i've known rocky for 30 years and i couldn't remember his last name uh rocky taylor uh, he went out on his own when we told him about this and gathered up, went to his friends and family members and got some bikes to donate. He's already started for this year. He's come to us and he's already started raising money to buy bikes for this year. Uh, we went to our oil vendors, uh, HN Funkhauser and Chesapeake Petroleum, both local companies here. Uh, they, they provided. Uh, Mock Specialty is a company that provides us with chemicals and things we use in our shop. They provided some as well, but all our vendors, and I'm missing a bunch of people, but, but associates brought in individual bikes. Uh, you know, once again, the vendors brought bikes. Our landscaper brought in bikes. We weren't shy about asking anybody and everybody. And we had our Christmas tree here in the middle of the showroom, and it was the whole area was surrounded by bikes. Uh, I brought the little pink trice, tricycle, so no, no, with the little bell. No, we bought a, we bought big bikes too. My wife and I, we, 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 we have that, and I even have a video on my phone of our used car manager Tommy Sanchez, who's a pretty good sized guy, test driving one of the bikes in the showroom. So we had fun, we had fun with it, and uh, you know the technicians loaded everything up in the vans and the vehicles. We brought them down to you guys, and what you do is is amazing. All of Carter Myers Automotive CMA. Uh, it's also a, a corporate approach that we do. So you could go to our Williamsburg Ford store and there's going to be a collection of bikes there for Toys R Tarts. You could go to our one of any one of our Charlottesville locations, our Stanton locations, and now with our more locations out here uh, with Honda, Hyundai, and we own Martinsburg, uh, Chevy and Toyota, and CDJR in Martinsburg. Uh, they're all collecting bikes every year as well. You never want to see a kid, a young kid, without something at Christmas. And whether it be a, a, an unwrapped toy that uh, these these people generously uh, move forward with uh, to these families that are in need, or a bicycle, and you just see our staff come through here, it, it's it's great we're doing it for the kids, but we're really doing it for ourselves. It makes us feel better, it makes us feel good, and when you come out here and there's this big collection, I mean you don't walk in many places you see 60 bikes sitting in the middle of the floor, and it's and it's and it's impressive, you know. But once again, it was a total dealership and community effort.